finally, the fall switcheroo. Hey y'all, it's April, and thanks for stopping by my channel, My Crazy Creative Life. It is finally the fall switcheroo. I'm finally getting in here and trying to get my fall decorations up. And we've already taken down my little girls here with me today. And we've taken, oh, I just see something I forgot. But uh, but we've taken down uh, the ocean decorations I had up. I didn't even bother with doing a, a video on that switcheroo because I didn't do a whole lot. So we've got everything with the exception of that sign down. And we're going to start decorating everything. So I'll just kind of show you bits and pieces as I go along. made that a few years ago. <laughs> I made this last year. I don't know what I think about it yet. It's supposed to be like you put it around your neck while you're cooking and you know, wipe your hands. And it, it was okay, but it's like, it's <sighs> maybe a little too long. I don't know, maybe if I make it again, I need to just take one of these and cut it in half. That way it would be like, that way, like that. But you can also, I think one reason why it's longer, I forgot, you can also use it to like take uh, something out of your oven. I don't know, that's what I made last year. If you're interested in seeing how I done it, let me know down in the comments. Anything, anything that I tell you I made, then you want to see how I do, done it, then uh, leave me a comment down in the description box below, and I will try to show you how. I usually above my cabinet. Um, I've got like the space between the cabinet and the wall and the ceiling, so I put like these little things up there. And I actually made these last year. Uh, I had my girl's birthday party because um, Havana is the end of October. Ariana is the first of November or the first part. And so I just, a lot of times I have their parties together. Well, she was really into Jack the Nightmare Before Christmas. And so the birthday party was kind of based on that. And so I made these that's supposed to be like Oogie Boogie and I don't break them. And that was supposed to be like, uh, Sally, I forgot her name. So I don't know where I'm gonna put these. I'll set them on my table. I don't know if I want them on that table or that table. I don't know, I'll figure it out. This little guy usually goes on my table over there by the door, that is a complete mess. So once I get it cleaned up, this will be going there. These at Dollar Tree three, four years ago or so. And they're like the little chalk, bo uh, chalk board things. And it says, I'm thankful for. And I've got my girls' names on it. And I hang them on their door, on the outside of their door every fall. Because I'm thankful for my girls. But I also do this for the kitchen too, which is starting to, the chalk, I'm gonna have to redo it. Like this one says, I'm thankful for God in my family. This one is definitely back on. It says, it's supposed to say, I'm thankful for food. Food and laughter was what that one is. I've got to redo that one. Once I do something with all this, this will be my candy ball. I usually have it sitting out on my counter and candy for us throughout the fall season, which I don't need, but. Oh, y'all yeah, like my little apron? It's got a little towel and my mom bought me this Christmas before last, I think. Bought me some new lights at the Meyer. So I got these at Meyer. I haven't decided if I'm putting them on the tree or putting them on the outside yet. Oh, here is, I was telling y'all about the, the mushroom lights. And if, you, if you've seen my haul, and if you haven't, I'll uh, link it up here. But I got these mushroom lights. <laughs> well, I pull them out, and they are really cute. 
tangled because they're cute. Anyway, you get the gist of it. And they are so cute, but they are they are not electric. They are battery operated. So, I don't know, it's kind of good and bad. I mean, you can move them anywhere you want, but half the time I either forget to turn the battery on or I'm afraid I'm gonna burn the battery out. So, I don't know how I feel about that. I made this maybe five, six years ago, and it started out as a clear vase. So if you are interested in learning how I've done that, let me know. I also made that too. This is starting to get kind of bad shape. I need to reflip it up. But when I was able to work, at one point I was a home health nurse, and one of my little patients, his wife, made me this that year. And she was, they, well, they both were the sweetest people, but she had made me that that year. And I've got lots in it somewhere. Another vase I made about the same time frame. two of these. My husband had bought me these last year at Hobby Lobby. Oh, I think they're so pretty. They will go on my big kitchen table when I get all my cannon stuff off. So, right now they're going back over here. Alright, now I'm just going to get everything straightened back up and then when I get everything done, then I'll show you like a tour. Okay. 